Hi there, I'm Will Kidd with Seven Seas Estate Sales here to give you a video walkthrough of our upcoming May 29th and 30th hybrid asset sale here in Hardin Valley. So let me say a couple things about those terms. It's a hybrid sale, which means there's an online auction with over 110 items and you can bid those items online. And then we have the tag sale in the house. So hundreds more items are for sale at tag prices here in the house. Now this sale opens Friday at 1 p.m. All the tag sale items will be for sale from that point. And the online auction, you can come in and see those items on Friday. The auction starts ending at 8 p.m. Friday night so that you, uh, you have a chance to preview it and then you can go home and place your final bids and watch the auction end, which is always really fun. I'm gonna give you a look around. This is a great sale. A uh, psychologist and his wife lived here and they collected absolutely beautiful things. So just right off the bat, I'm showing you that we've got these great uh, assortment of oriental rugs on the floor. Some of these are machine made. Many of them are hand knotted, you know, thousands of knots and weeks or months or years sometimes and to make one of these rugs. So they are all over the house and absolutely beautiful check the website for photos now as i spin back around this way you're going to see this is one of the best gramophones we've ever had it winds it runs the condition is beautiful you look inside and it's got records in a cabinet you push the little button and it pops one of the records out if it's in there so that's very cool and uh, we have additional 78 records that you can um, buy to go with that here in the sale now artwork we have all over this house you see a couple pieces there some specialty pieces up here as i go up on the ceiling these are all real movie posters and the interesting thing about these particular ones for this family is that um, uh, one of the family's sons was actually one of the producers on all of these different films so that's why we've got that particular mix in the house and uh so if you like those movies come grab one and if you like uh just you know the frame is worth the the opening bid on all these so uh jump in and get yourself some cool entertainment memorabilia there's a bunch more in the auction we'll show that here in a minute now i'm coming to the parlor we're looking at this neat piece is a um a sampling of quilt patterns now it looks like it's woven it's convincing but it's actually a print signed and numbered and then we've got a really cool uh, chair here i love these two pieces in the tag sale there are these oriental cabinets kind of like jewelry cabinets or storage cabinets then we've got um, here's a chagall poster that's in the tag sale here's a signed piece that's in the online auction and you can see underneath that one of the great chairs that's the cane back bottom and back uh, chair here that's pretty awesome here's a new item coming to the sag sale that's an antique cash register drawer and uh, there's the other oriental cabinet coming up uh, another beautiful piece of art i thought i couldn't name every piece of art in here there's about 30 or so in the auction and there's twice that many in the tag sale beautiful lamp great little table there that's in the tag sale the sofa is in the tag sale i'm sorry no the sofa is that's a the sleeper sofa it's in the online auction and then you've got more art up there uh, um, uh, that is bidding and uh, there's several iCart prints here that are in the tag sale now if i come back out we're going to go i'm going to bypass the living room uh, we'll come back to it in a minute but you can see there is a the little entertainment cabinet lots of cds they got lots of good record albums in here coming down the hallway there's a cool dr pepper mirror more of this art some tags some is in the online auction and i come into this neat bedroom here and we've got some of the great oak pieces in here now all the furniture in the house just about all of it is oak and it's gorgeous this thing is just in fabulous condition a nice very tall uh, uh, oak wardrobe and then spinning around one of my favorite pieces that i've ever had i love the serpentine center part here with the square top above it and the slightly recessed drawers below that is just a fabulous piece of furniture that's in the online auction and you could grab that mirror which is bidding separately to go with it of course we've got the pat summit bobblehead and some of the cool other uh, uh, decor that you'll find around this house Here's a uh, Remington print, Remington Red, yeah, Frederick Remington print. All these decorative pillows are in the tag sale. And uh, then all the beautiful pieces of artwork here. This guy, this family, they really loved their local ceramic artists. And you'll see lots and lots of neat, good quality ceramics here in the house. Here's one of the most interesting ones, this head vase. Freaky and cool. And then another one of my favorites is over here on the wall. Um, really had a big challenge getting a good photograph of it because either the flash would light and it would be the wrong color but I think it's coming up pretty true color here on the video so that is one cool piece that's a that's a woven not well it's, it's part woven and part sewn really a really great piece of art you also got a good Sears uh, Kenmore sewing machine in here okay and then uh, sewing equipment and a lot kind of stuff to go with it coming back in the hallway got a closet full of good clothes both men's and women's mediums 
designer stuff, quality stuff, everything's good here. And then on the opposite side of this little hallway, we've got a good linen closet with all your goodies in there. Now, when I pop in here, I mentioned other, or I mentioned earlier that we have more entertainment memorabilia. Look at this, the Beatles in mono CD set. Check it out on eBay, it's hundreds of dollars. So it's the Brady Bunch. This is Masters of Horror season one and two with the collector things, that's hundreds of dollars. True Blood, got Pee Wee Herman. We've got, let me lift that one up here. There's your Star Trek Voyager seasons one through seven. There's Star Trek History, Babylon five. There's all kind of this stuff uh, in the online auction as is this really great pair of wingback chairs. And one of my favorite things, again, I love these maps with the top of topographical features on it, you know, where you can see it's, it's they're bumpy. You can see the mountains, you can sort of see the terrain of East Tennessee, and this is all of East Tennessee. Uh, really a great one there. Four of the individual ones married onto one frame. Got a couple of the um, uh, Stu Eichel prints in here. There, I think there's four or five in the in the auction altogether. More art around here, and uh, I love this piece. Uh, one of the large ones. There's a poster we just brought in late. Here's an original oil painting. Here's Otis. We've got I think four Otis in the auction. Uh, great block printer. You know, really an interesting technique that to make art. Uh, some great collectible books over here in the corner, Life magazines, other magazines, the Esquire Girl calendars and the Ballyhoo calendars. You want to see what a collectible runs, look those things up individually from the 1940s and 50s on eBay. You'll see they're expensive. And there's one of the, another one of the iCart prints and another one of our signed European guys. Now, two little chairs tucked here in the corner. I love the good uh, um, ladder back chairs and then closet. Again, chock full, men's, women's, uh, a lot of it new, some of it a little bit worn, but it's going to be bargain priced. And if you wear mediums, you can get some good clothes out of here, I promise you. All right, now I'm going to shoot back through here. We'll catch another a couple pieces that I bypassed uh, furniture-wise. On the other side of the room, I've got the great cedar chest. That's a beauty of a cedar chest. And, uh, and then I've got this nice uh, chest or, or dresser. And then this piece, and once again, beautiful oak. Uh, it's really like a china cabinet, but they put that curtain on it to keep clothing in it. Convert it back, keep it the way it is, whichever you like. And I forgot to mention underneath all those collectibles we had earlier, those are, that's another nice little chest of drawers there. Uh, we've got quilts in the auction. There's some uh, bidding, some not bidding, and a lot of nice linens and great sweaters, etc., all through the house. Coming back out of that hallway into the living room, there's a second little sleeper sofa there. And then we've got a nice pair of shield back chairs, more art. Look at all the collectibles on the shelves here. Chock full of good books. They got really interesting reading in this house. Um, uh, here's your uh, phonology. If you want to know how to read somebody's head and tell their fortune, there's a little phrenological head there. A um, couple of uh, antique lamps and the uh, reproduction butter churn there uh, in the online auction. And then a bunch of other doodads in the tag sale. More interesting artwork on the shelves in the tag sale stepping back out here i've got a beautiful uh, print in the tag sale above the mantle and then up high that's haitian art if you don't know too much about haitian metal drum art this is actually pounded out of the side of metal drums which is one of the few resources i have sitting around in haiti this is a known artist listed guy hubert bernard and uh that's a tree of life piece very cool then swinging off over here into the shadows, I'm afraid, there's another Frederick Remington print, and again, more books. There's a great little uh, teeter tot, one of the vintage child's uh, rocking toys, uh, faux, uh, yeah, faux plant there. Got some good games and such like that. If we peek out the window, uh, yeah, there's you can see the patio set out there, and this really cool, you gotta check out the umbrella. It raises from the top, it doesn't have a pole underneath. So it's got like an arced arm that reaches over. That's a pretty cool piece. They're 500 bucks at Costco right now. That one's on the online auction. So you got a chance for a steal there. Pair of good looking chairs here uh, with the spindle backs in oak once again. Then check this out. All along the uh, kitchen uh, counters, we have artwork, pottery, ceramic, antiques. I love, I love the dance fondue pot. Makes me want to eat fondue right now just looking at it. And then uh, more, again, more ceramics, glassware, everything you need there. Look at this run of ceramic on this side. Bowls, pitchers, colanders, you name it, all kind of beauties in here. And uh, spinning back through, uh, give you a peek into the pantry. Chock full, we got food, we got cookware, bakeware, collectible tins, you name it. It's chock full in this one. 
and I'm not getting around the corner for you there, but it keeps on going, that pantry does. Then I've got Dansk dishes here. Uh, there's some Dansk, uh, no, actually they're from Belgium, those uh, funky little canisters. All your good uh, hand tools. Got a nice bowl and pitcher up there, that's a beauty. Good uh, kitchen appliances, beer mugs, glasses, scale, everything you need in the kitchen. Stepping back, we've got the, uh, the nice setup of pots and pans up here. We've got a nice set on the stove. On and on it goes. Now, swinging over this way, you know I've skipped something. I've got to go across the room. I totally forgot. One of the most interesting things in the house is this black amethyst collection. Now, if you don't know what black amethyst glass is, let me see if there's any way I can get us an example here. I'm going to hold this up. And, uh, well, that was a good old solid black. Let me pick a different one here. I'll put this up straight at the light and look through it. It's purple, okay? That's amethyst glass or purple. And uh, so a lot of this glass is this kind that sort of shines through purpley. That's what they call black amethyst glass. There's a collector's book on this if you want to study some of this stuff up while you're here. And there's a really wide variety of items from little bowls to... <laughs> you know, um, uh, reamers to candlesticks to all different kind of shapes of vases, tumblers, pitchers, everything you want to see. And you got to check this out. This is a really fabulous oak dining table, exceptionally wide. It is a really wide table. You can just easily put two people on the end of that. It's uncommon in a dining table. Need a little bigger space, of course, for it, but this is great. And it's got a set of chairs to go with it. Get on the online auction, check out the dimensions. If it fits in your house, place a bid. It's awesome. And then back over here, oh, shoot, well, my lighting's not too good here, but I've got this beautiful curved glass uh, uh, china cabinet, and it is, yeah, there's bringing up the light a little bit, chock full. You can see the white dots, but there's lots of black glass in there as well. And one more side chair here. Down the hallway, which I'm going to bypass, there is the beautiful oak roll top desk. Headed back over here, <clears throat> I've got a tea cart. That's going to be in the tag sale. And then there's this oak table. It's a second oak table, this one with two leaves in the middle. And we've got fondue plates. If you come for the Dansk fondue pot, you've got fondue plates you can get there. And there's a great set of Italian uh, dishware uh, that you can brew up some pasta and go with. Here's my back stock on art. I ran out, used every nail in the house. We have more pieces as things sell. We're just going to keep covering up the walls. Uh, a little bit more art out here in the garage. And of course, we're going to have the standard tools. Got your ladder, got a couple of good shelves. This is these uh, little plastic shoe boxes here are full of you know the hardware and stuff that every house has and every house needs. There is a good um, file cabinet for you, and then we've got lots of fun yard art and miscellaneous in here, little tables, decoratives. Here's a this is one thing you may uh, never decide that you need, but that's one of the comfy trainers you can put your bicycle on this, pedal away and stationary so you can use your own bike to set up that uh, type of thing which you normally would just pedal in a gym fans faux plants got an extension ladder got the uh, you know coffee mugs all kind of luggage sitting in there here's a vibrating you know chair seat on and on we go folks i'm going to quit here you can see uh, yard tools but i'm going to stop there come on out and see us friday starts at 1 p.m on the 29th Watch the online auction. That'll end Friday starting at 8 p.m. And it's one item per minute after that. So it'll close a little bit after 10 o'clock. Uh, so thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you at the sale. Thanks.